the efficacy of long-lasting insecticidal nets, lens, and insecticide-treated nets against Anopheles mosquitoes. This article is written by four authors. First author I. Maya Thander. Second author Fio Wei Wen. Third author So So Tr Last author Mong Mong Maya. Contribution and originality of the study is that, this study contributes to existing literature to develop a testing method for investigation the bioefficacy of ITN nets and lens nets. Field bioefficacy of 0, 5, 10, 15 and 20 times washed permanent 2.0, icon lin, delta methrin and icon treated cotton and nylon nets, ITN. Against wild caught Anopheles mosquitoes were tested with WHO cone test kit method in my Abanthra village Mayavi Township, Mag region. Mosquitoes were exposed in cones for 5 minutes and 15 minutes fixed exposure period under room temperature in raining and cold season. Knockdown effect was measured after 60 minutes of exposure. In raining and cold season, a total of 221 and 196 mosquitoes, consist of 8 and 6 species of Anopheles adults were collected. Maximum number of an coolicifices was caught followed by in Vegas and cattle bait canet, human bait and lowest was collected in morning resting collection. In both season maximum number of main vector in Minimus was caught on human and cattle bait collection between 2100 hours and 24,000 hours. The bioefficacy of 0 and 5 washed all permanent 2.0, Icon and Delta Methrine lens and ITNs found 100% knockdown ability with all caught mosquitoes. Undot minimus and undot coolicifices found to be 80 to 100% knockdown effect against 10 washes with permanent 2.0 and icon lens in both season. Knockdown efficacy was significantly declined between 5 and 20 washes, 100 to 60% knockdown on lens and 90 to 20% for delta methrin and icon treated nets in both season. Permanent 2.0 Icon lens were found higher wash resistance ability till 15 washes than delta methrin and icon treated cotton net but nylon net was found lowest wash resistance needs repeated treatment. Thanks for watching this video of Journal of Diseases Volume 6 Issue Number 2.